What's going on YouTube? So it's Martin and Christina from, from Thrift, Thrift Store Gold. Gold back at you with another video. So today's video we have a big bag. We got a haul. Not too big of a bag but we got a clothing haul to show you guys. So we're going to show you and as Christina's talking and showing you I'm going to be taking pictures so we can kind of knock two birds with one stone in this video and get some pictures done and film a video. So uh, enough of this rant. We'll roll this intro and we'll be right back. So now that you guys are back from that intro, if you're new here, her name is Christina, my name is Martin. This is kind of awkward that we're just standing here, but it's the video of today. Like I said in the beginning, we have this big bag of clothes to go over. We actually haven't looked in it one bit at all. We got it from our friend Ashley Zach, so thank you Zach if yes. you ever get to watching this. Funny, if you guys know who Zach is, you might wonder why he's not reselling it himself. Uh, they're his own clothes and he doesn't like to do clothing. So. Yeah, he's not a fan of clothing, so we'll take it. So, <laughs> we figure how, well I figured how it's going to go is she's going to show the items off and once she's done showing you guys, she's going to hand it to me and I'm going to take the pictures on the wall. So, let's just break right into it. So we're kind of get set up. Oh, my phone is. Mm. So, while Martin's looking for his phone, or do you want me to just pause? No, you can go. Okay. While Martin's looking for his phone, first thing we have is a striped Nautica t-shirt. Uh, just a plain, just like basic t-shirt. Just use the Yeah. Uh, right. It'll be easier anyways. Uh, but anyway, so, a plain Nautica striped t-shirt. It's a navy blue. I don't know if you guys, I'll probably come up a little bit. But yeah, so just a nice navy blue t-shirt. Size medium. Oh yeah, I gotta give it to you. Nice size medium. And then, Levi's. We have really good luck with Levi's, so maybe we can lot this together with a pair of jeans that we have. But just a nice uh, graphic t-shirt. I think these are all probably size medium, because that's his size, but... Nice, just like denim colored shirt with like nice bright uh, yellow coloring, Levi's. And then there's Martin. He's so ghetto. He'll never get a tripod stand for this light. Oops. And see? Because you stepped on my cord. I, but I accidentally you, tripped on it. The, the tripod or not, <laughs> you still would have stepped on it. But it wouldn't have been there. But anyways, next thing is another Nautica t-shirt. Um, so he told us that there's a few of them in there, so we're probably going to lock these together. So I'll find all of the colored Nautica shirts that we have and put them together for now. Uh, but this is like a darkish gray blue. Uh, really nice, but then the black like logo up top. So yeah, the Where reason do oh, I don't use a tripod is because I can keep this in my hand and move forward, move back, do however I please with it. And I think it's just easier, in my eyes. No, no. <laughs> okay, so stuff that, I'm gonna put the stuff over there because I have to find all of the shirt, like not the shirts. Oh, that's fine, yeah. I mean, we can make room on this table if you want. That's okay. All right, so, what are you cutting out of this and stuff? Are you Nothing. just running all of it? Yeah, in? it's just like... That's fine. Well, I was just... We've actually, thank you guys, we've gotten some good reviews on the videos that are just kind of like raw, no cutting. Just because they're slower paced, people can actually like, someone commented and said they can kind of understand the video more that it's just slower, you know? Nice. Good, so thank good, you. Good. Really appreciate that feedback. I'm glad we're able to make better videos for you guys now. Um, yes, I'm liking how the videos are going, kind of just more like laid back and chill, not like such like a video, like we just kind of hang video. out. Um, right, I'm going to try to find these Nautica things. So many now. I feel like, does Zach really own this many clothes? Is there a lot in there or like no? Yeah, there's a lot. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just trying to figure out some colors right now, but Zach is the most bougie person in the world. But anyways, uh, other Nautica shirts that we have, we have this green one, uh, like a nice forest green. 
Uh, nice size medium as well. I don't know if we'll do a lot of, because right now I found four Nautica shirts, but uh, definitely, oh yeah, I forgot to say. Yeah, fine. Definitely those two colors will go together just because they look nice. And Within then, the sleeve I go. Uh, oh, completed. So yeah, I'm going to try to find some more before I... Where should I take pictures? Nike. Don't worry, I will show all of these off again. I just need to... <laughs> I, was gonna say. I just need to get them all situated. Oh man, I need to get some tape for this stupid plug. This thing comes undone more than you guys would think. Okay, I'm not... Well, I shouldn't say I'm not selling this. We'll look up the long johns, but... What the heck, Zach? Zach. I feel like Zach should know this. I feel like he's just trying to troll us I at know. this point. <laughs> Alright, so... Yeah, those two will be good together for clothes. Okay. All right, sweet. So, next thing for the two Nautica, well, Nautica pile, I guess. Actually, three. Um, we have a black t-shirt. So, nice plain black one. This is actually a pocket tee uh, with a black logo on it. So, you can't even see it. It's actually a really nice one. Size medium as well. Oh wow, there's a ton. Look at guys. <laughs> I know. It just kept coming. All right. So I take it back that one blue Nautica shirt that you'll see in a second is actually long sleeve. Uh, so the black one and this like cream colored will probably lot together. Uh, just because Nautica t-shirts, they sell well for us. They seemingly like we can't keep them in our stores, but they just don't sell for a lot together. Uh, so we're going to try to put two shirts together and see what we can get out of it. Uh, but another medium, nice like beige-ish beige tan with a black logo up top. Um, so this will be our next lot of stuff. And then, let's see, hold on, I feel like there's not a lot of talking, but I can't really do it. I hope you guys are enjoying your day. <laughs> if it's morning, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day. If it's nighttime, I hope you had an amazing day. Amazing. If it's midday, I hope you enjoyed your morning and you have a great rest of your day. Hmm. Should we just do a lot of five? I feel and like I, that's too many though. Nah. Like, pictures won't really fit. <laughs> unless you get like one shot of the front and back. Because then that's ten. And then a shot of all of them together. Hmm. Nah. We'll do white and black. And then we'll do green, red, and blue. Alright, so we have a white Nautica long sleeve shirt. Um, still playing with just like a black logo up top. Uh, but we're going to lot this together with a black Nautica long sleeve with actually a white logo. Uh, so this one sticks out a little bit more, which is nice. Um, but yes, yeah, so these, this black one and this white one are two that we are going to lot to try with these Nautica long sleeves. We, I should say, we don't do a lot of long sleeves with these Nauticas, more so just the short sleeves. Um, I'm right here. <laughs> But they should still hopefully sell well, uh, especially just because they're in really nice condition. As I was whispering that Zach's the most bougie person in the whole world, uh, these shirts, some of them have probably been worn like once. This one's got a nice stain on the sleeve. Yeah, I was going to say some of them I got a stains. picture of it. Do you have, well I can fold these if you Yeah, want. I mean if you want, I'm just trying to save space and not have just be a chaotic mess on the table. Okay, so the long sleeve nauticas that will be long together with for colors, we have a nice blue one, just navy or like electric blue, and then we have a red one, well this blue one has a white logo, this red one's got a black logo, and then I like army green color, so let's see, this one's got a black logo as well. So really nice condition. These are all actually, I'm going to show this off a little bit, but like the vinyl tag. Um, I don't know of what actual other Nautica tags look like besides this, but uh, these tags 
seem to ha, all right I guess that's one of them uh, but still same lettering just different color but regardless you can see that that one's a lot more faded than the other Nautica tag so like this white one is in really good condition but this black one that I just showed probably was worn a little bit more you can see it's not as in good of condition so you can kind of tell really the quality based off of these like Nautica shirts on that tag because they fade so easily just like Victoria's Secret bra tags all right five bucks to whoever counts how many times Christina says Nautica in this video I know <laughs> I've already but it's the end of Nautica so no but just how many times you've said it how many times we will say it I was already thinking I said it a lot but next few things that we have here let's see oh yes I was, so as I was pulling oh, these yes as I was pulling these clothes out uh, I realized that a lot of them were like similar brands they're all the same size which is nice because they came from our the one person uh, so it makes it easy for us but there's three Levi sh Levi shirts here and so we're probably gonna lot these together just because we've had Levi shirts before in the past that sit in our store forever Ever. so like that's what really when I pulled the one out I was like oh we could lot it with some jeans I'm gonna lot these three together because it'll just make it a better selling point for people um, and I don't think Levi t-shirts are that expensive to get in store I'm so. not too too sure but here we have just like a nice green one there actually is a stain right on the front of this one and uh, oh that's the meat hold on all right there it is but it's so tiny it really doesn't take away from the shirt so still a nice one you know what i'm thinking <clears throat> what? do you want to grab the camera and just get close and i'll tell, show the people how i'm taking pictures really quick In now case... or after oh i guess we can wait till like the last one Figured, cause I was gonna do that for the last, just cause I don't have that much left. That's fine. It's better than having to try and put it back. After right. you're done, you can just help me with like the rotating the yep. shirts and stuff, you know. And so then we have another Levi T-shirt, still in really good quality. This one's actually really thick, like one of those heavy cotton ones. It's really long too, uh, but we'll we'll lot it together with that other blue shirt and this striped shirt here. Uh, but just some nice Levi like graphic dang all right so we're gonna lot those two t-shirts together because I should have really looked at these more <laughs> they're the same style t-shirt so we have this like minty green pocket t-shirt and then we have a striped white and blue pocket t-shirt from Levi so these two will lot together and then this black one I'll either list by itself or we'll put it, throw them in with a pair of jeans. Uh, typically, oh, this is actually a large too, so it's a little bit bigger. Uh, but typically we find bigger size jeans, so that's where it would be a little bit harder. But being that it's a large, a little bit bigger size, we can fit find more sizes that go with that. What did I show it off? Levi. I wonder how many times they've heard my knees crack or like <laughs> crack. Okay. All right, so true real fans, comment down below your favorite song. Cause it's so random. <laughs> uh, I'm calling you up, Vincent Jones Smith. If you don't uh, comment the song. Vincent Jones Smith. Okay. Vincent. Vincent. That's what I said. I know. No, I was correcting myself. I thought oh. I got it wrong. So then we have two pairs of American Eagle shorts. Um, let's see the size. Oh, you know, it's funny. Size 30. What? Yesterday in our video, Cajun was like, a prop. What about Stormy? Because <laughs> we were saying True. we brought Finn in the videos. We got Bert. And then I was like, oh, yeah, I guess Stormy. Stormy doesn't like to be on camera, though. She, Stormy doesn't want to be on camera. <laughs> um, but anyways, both size 30, just like khaki American Eagle shorts. Uh, we have a navy blue and then a light tan khaki color um so really nice and then actually there was one american eagle t-shirt in here so i'm gonna lot it together with those pair two pair of shorts and kind of do like a bundle of american eagle um 
I guess Martin doesn't know men's sizes for anything so like someone should let me know down in the comments below if medium and size 30 go well together medium shirts and size 30 pants it's different for everyone so I know that's what's so tough but like just a general idea <laughs> and then next thing we have lastly some Nike t-shirts and a tissue Nike uh, this one's definitely older. I don't know. This one will probably just ah. Uh, this one's definitely not getting sold. It's fine. I'll show you why in a second. So this is all cracked and terrible. <laughs> it's still a really cool shirt. It would have been nice if it wasn't cracked. Terrible. And then there's a hole up here in the arm sleeve. Oh, we're about to end filming, so. So there's a hole actually in this arm sleeve up here so uh, I mean I could put maybe throw it in with the other shirts but not really like it might be the one thing that gets people to not buy the lot I know I was gonna say I might just like throw it in afterwards and be like hey I found an extra Nike size medium shirt if you hate it throw it out <laughs> or we'll just give it to Zach or burn it no I'm kidding we'll donate it before we burn it guys <laughs> But anyway, I gotta watch sometimes what I say on camera. I'm joking around and sometimes I forget so It's just the sense of humor. I have I'm myself in these videos. I don't hold back No, he does not <laughs> uh, So with these Nike shirts though Nike tends to sell for us really nicely for a good price by themselves So I'm gonna list all of these separately um, la, la. Even though they are very similar obviously in uh, size, but then even the style you guys see here uh, but so we have one Nike shirt with a little gray and Nike swoosh up at the top It's like a blue uh, Darker blue not really like navy. I guess this is more of a navy blue. So whatever a navy blue t-shirt Oh, no, no, not that one. Sorry The crack doesn't go the terrible one. Yeah. Those you gotta do too. Oh, yeah. Terrible and then we have this bright yellow Nike shirt. Yellow is actually his favorite color. I'm surprised we didn't have more yellow in here. But uh, just Save one of those. Shirts. True. Just the regular Nike, I think, go to T? No, the Nike T. Um, but just with one big white swoosh on the front. Remember we thought the one that said the Nike T, we were like, that's got to be fake. But I wish we could still find it because and compare them to this now because yeah. it definitely was the fake. The lettering was like, so off, but it was so weird because we never noticed that the tag says the, the Nike T. Yeah, so if you're ever wondering, it literally does say the Nike T, which is just weird. But I feel like we kept that red shirt because... Oh, 100%. Like, we, I know where it is. It's in the kids... Where? I'm gonna go get it so we I'm can... I'm pretty sure it's in the kids' bin. Guys! You got me, guys. So now I'm doing Zach's favorite yellow shirt. Oh, look it. Oh, he's growling. <laughs> it's Finn. Say hi, Finn. I let him get back to his sleep. Yeah, we've been having so much construction going on on the street actually outside. So it's been really hard to find time to film because it's just been a lot of like jackhammering, digging, machine work, all that construction stuff. So it's really just like we've just been having to kind of like not film and wait for times where we can film. It's not. It's not. Oh well. But anyways, just to reiterate what we were talking about real quickly, sorry if you were saying something. Nope. It's very easy to find like fake clothing in stores and it's so similar that it looks real, but really pay attention to like how the letters are placed, like the, the spacing font. in between letters, the font of letters, and just pay really close detail. Just take, there's a shirt in here. So. Yeah, there's a shirt really close detail to just all of stuff like that and even like like even if it is like an amazing fake there will be something on there that you'll be able to tell that it is off but anyways for the last shirt we have this light blue nike just the nike tee with a ooh, a dark blue logo up top so that is the last of actually all the clothes besides this <laughs> 
Okay, I lied. <laughs> The there is John. one long John shirt in here, which that I That one we might actually burn. <laughs> Nobody would want to buy that from a thrift I know. store. And I know. Well, so we always make fun of Zach because he wears... I feel like I shouldn't call this out. I don't it's care. Whatever. Uh, he always He's wears long Johns underneath his shorts, or underneath his pants during the time. We live in Buffalo. To make them soft for him rather than jean material, so... He's got, I don't know if he threw this in on purpose. He's got the world's worst leg hair problem. So it gets caught in his jeans and stuff, he says. All right, he's not like Sasquatch. I feel like you should be careful with what you say. The you don't have to be Sasquatch to have hairy hair. legs. But you said the world's worst leg hair. He does problem. have the world's worst leg hair. All right, so anyways, I'm going to bring this over here now and show you guys exactly how Martin takes these pictures. Sorry, that was really... <laughs> Make him throw up. Yes. So anyways, uh, right now he's taking a picture of the tag, so taking a picture of the tag is literally the worst thing on pants. These ones will be easy. Yeah, fold it that way. And then... Uh, so I don't know if you guys noticed or not, but it was like a smaller screen on our camera. I feel like we've definitely explained it before, I but... I don't know if we have. We're in the one by one setting in the one zoom on the camera so the little square setting it's not called square anymore on the iphone 11s it's called one by one but uh you get to it by going to or is it oh it is still called square yeah. light okay it's just the ratio one like one over one ratio so on old phones they show it on the screen called square and like it's, it's super, super nice. easy to find that one's not easy to find but anyways uh, i don't think you took did you take a picture of the back yeah okay so I did. This okay, is so, a mess. No, this was my plan. I wanted to get the last two items <laughs> with you to take pictures. So these, this pants and these shorts, I'll show you. <laughs> this so is you a, a terrible angle. I'm sorry. Yeah, hanger with the clips. The clip. Pants are the worst. Sometimes I just fold them and lay them on the ground. We were into the like flat lay for a while, but wow. uh, we switched it up just because. I don't know. It was. N I think it's nicer to get a view of like this in a cover yeah. shot rather than like just folded. But anyways. So I just take my light, hold it over, put this one there, and boom. Take it. Then I come closer. I'm just gonna put that down. For now. Unbutton. Open wide. Open sesame. Oops. I feel like also the picture looks really good on like my phone, but uh, the like just reflection of the lights making it look very washed out, but it's really oh, not on yeah. camera, guys. I'm like getting the exposures and stuff set on the phone. I can, what's it called? <laughs> yeah. Also, tip um, always make sure you button the buttons that are on the back and. I didn't do it with the last pair. Look at them. Oh, there's no buttons. Sweet. Oh, good. Well, just to, just because um, it helps show off the buttons, obviously, more. And then uh, if people are wondering, because I've had people ask me if, like, hey, does the back have buttons? Does the back have this? And I'm like, yes, it's in my picture. All right, so like I said, there was, like, an orange glow around that light. It really does look good in pictures. <laughs> you're fine, you're fine. I'm just going to keep it on the wall. All right, and then... I guess maybe what you have been waiting for is the shirts. <laughs> the shirts. So a nice Nike one that I was showing off. You do that. Oh, there's a stain. I know. I was going to tell you. You go boom. And so then I'll get closer, take a picture of that stain, and then just kind of pull the, ta the front of the shirt down, and you can get the tag in there. You see that? Perfect. And then before Ooh. you switch your shirt, I want to show off the stain. So, actually put that down. If you guys can see, you can't see the stain right now with the light not on it, which is really ridiculous. But once you place the light on it, uh... <laughs> Somewhere. Go down with the camera. Like this? So I can go up. Nah. All right, well, the stain I'll is the right here. I'll put the pictures from the shirt. <laughs> the stain's right here, if you guys can believe me. But basically, when we take pictures of stuff like that, and you can't see the stain in 
normal lighting but then you can see it with like our studio lighting i do claim that on the picture like the stain looks a lot lot worse because of like our studio lights mm -hmm. uh, if anybody ever asks us about it so maybe that's a tip and so then you just flip the shirt and get a picture of the back side and that's it for today's video i believe woot, woot. we got all our pictures done we got our lighting we went through the hall we hope you guys enjoyed that. Christina's having a heck of a fun time with the camera. I don't film. Let's film Finn for a second. We'll show you guys Finn. He's chilling. Hey, man. Oops, that was my head, not Finn. You sweet. All right, so we'll let you guys go. <laughs> we hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's been kind of like our new style of just like a live stream-esque video. So we've been enjoying them. We hope you guys have been enjoying them. Smash that like button if you like this video. Leave a comment down below if you got any questions or if you want to just spread some positivity in this world or if you want to just do anything. So you want to say hi to Finn Mans, he'd appreciate all the love. So on that note, we'll let you guys go. Have a great rest of your day. Peace. Okay. Oh, yeah. You do it. Okay, so before we actually let you guys go, Christina just, well, I found something and then Christina was like, oh, I'll explain that. And then she's like, well, let's pull the camera back out. <laughs> Yes, so a lot of companies now, I shouldn't say a lot, but companies now have been making single stitch lookalikes, so like current single stitches. So this shirt right here uh, totally looks single stitch. Uh, well, I guess it is single stitch, but when you flip it on the inside, uh, it actually is double stitched, just made to look single stitch. So, show. So like Levi's, they're kind of, I feel like a more hipstery brand to like look all vintage and stuff. This mm -hmm. shirt is also a single stitch shirt, but did it focus? Mm -hmm. Okay. But on the inside it's double stitched. Wow. So hold this. The camera? Yeah. Okay. I don't know if I'm supposed to be talking or not right now, but yeah guys, it's just kind of crazy. So this is an actual single stitch. Can you film this now? Yep. So in comparison to what you just saw this is what a single stitch really looks like. There's really almost no like stitching stitch. And then the inside is just one seam. It's one single stitch. So just so you guys don't ever like see this in the thrift store and think, Woo, I got a single stitch when it is just like a new print single stitch. Yeah. There's I feel like I know black is such it's a really bad... hard to tell this difference, but <laughs> But yeah, like so Don't get so close, but yeah. There's that, and then, so the non-new, or the new single stitch, and then the older vintage actual single stitch. Oh yeah, you can see it. Much difference, much difference. There was a big difference much there. Much difference. So. so that was the video. We'll let you guys go now. Peace. Punch it.